morning guys today is day seven of my 90 days of momentum journey and marks the first a week from the time that i started this um and i'm really pumped about what's going on as you all already know um today's plans are that i am i wasn't able to make it to brooklyn a uh, part of my breakdown uh i didn't set my alarm so i didn't get up on time um but we're rescheduling for next week but in the time that i was supposed to be going to brooklyn i'm going to be working on what i would have been working on there anyway here at home uh, or probably in the cafe for a bit before i head out to east harlem to do my first volunteer opportunity with newyorkcares.org um which will be reading to a bunch of five to seven year olds for about an hour then after that i'll be heading downtown to pick up my younger brother who will be joining the momentum movement by um, starting his basic journey today I'm really excited about that and then after that while he's in his um, course I'm gonna be going to support my LT member Erica Leeds as she um, gets donations for her volunteer trip to Haiti um, which is taking place in the month of December and in between that, and uh, I'll probably be working on things, but it seems like a really packed day as it is. So um, I look forward to reporting back what has been done. Um, and hopefully you all touch, move, and inspire someone throughout your day. Have a productive day and a happy dream chasing. Hey guys, so I'm now in East Harlem. I'm on my way to my first volunteer opportunity at um, the Association for Children something something. Um, I should probably know that but we are gonna be reading to the kids ages five through seven um, and just teaching them that reading is fun and things like that so I'm really excited um, it'll be for about an hour before I head downtown to pick up my brother who's actually around now um, so until later I will see you then I'm so excited okay this is where I'm we're here supporting Erica as she prepares to volunteer in the Dominican Republic. It's really loud in this corner to take some art supplies to the kitties. The lights really bright, and I guess. Good job, Erica. We're proud of you. Yay, LT120 for your support. Yay. And this is my auntie, Auntie Beth. If, if you ever hear me talking about my auntie sled buddy, this is. I'm talking about. Okay, this video is long. Sky, gal, lady. <laughs> okay, we're, we're, we're leaving. It's getting late, and I gotta pick up Brian from Basic. Okay. Day seven of 90 Days of Momentum has now come to a close. This is my younger brother, Brian, who just finished the night one of Basic. Hey, well, that, was really, that was interesting. He's not sold yet, I don't think. <laughs> but don't worry, by day three or four of him being here, I'm pretty sure that he'll have a completely different reaction. It is just day one. You gotta give the journey some time. Um, so today was really, really amazing. I uh, managed to, like I said, do my volunteer opportunity with the kids. So cute they were five to seven year olds it turns out that the um, name of the organization was the association um of benefit benefiting children or something like that and it's they call it abc um and it's an organization that's dedicated towards helping children that have gone through traumatic life experiences like say homelessness or maybe being abused at one point or something like that and just interacting with them and helping them build social skills um, and just, I guess, getting past those things. Um, so I read to them, I uh, helped a kid color. We read this cute book about um, filling a bucket and emptying a bucket based on doing good and bad deeds. And then um, after that, I got to play Battleship with a kid named, uh, a kid. But um, I, it, it was weird, I, I didn't know how to play. So most of the time we actually weren't playing the game so much as I was trying to figure out how to play the game by reading the instructions, but it was still a good time. Um, after that, I went to pick up this guy. Uh, then after that, we fought with traffic for about an hour. I'm in New York, <laughs> New York traffic is awful. Stop! <laughs> like, I really wish I would've taken the train. <laughs> Life would have been probably a little easier for both of us. We got out at 
so no, that's coming back. Uh, I'm talking about getting there. Oh, yeah. That took a long time too, and it should have only taken 15 minutes. Yeah. It took almost an hour. And then after that, um, while he was in Momentum, I went down to support Erica, you saw, so awesome. And um, I haven't really spoken much about this, but there are a couple of things that, um, um, yeah, like, <laughs> he's like, I ain't trying to eat no, I ain't trying to eat no burnt fried eggs. <laughs> Um, there are a lot of a couple of things that I mentioned in my goals that I haven't fully um, gone into detail about. Like with the twenty thousand uh, dollar goal that I set in increased jewelry sales, um, something that I really want to do, and I'll elaborate on this a lot more, is um, de donate fifteen percent of all of the sales of Kerika jewelry going forward, um, especially the things that are sold online, towards um, supporting the arts in underdeveloped or third world countries, developing countries, and so, <laughs> um, so that um, the arts are really promoted over there as well because education is important but as um, someone explained to me tonight, art is something that moves the spirit and the spirit is not something that um, it is something that you can't just teach, you know, it's something that really has to be brought out from within. So that's really important to me and um, I'll elaborate on that, but with the program that Erica is doing, they're going to be volunteering in the Dominican Republic with arts and I feel like that's probably something that I'm going to end up doing next year, so I'm really excited. Um, da, 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 da. There's so much more to talk about, but it's late, basically, it's almost 3 o'clock and um, I have to be up at seven to move my car one that's wrong oh so it's two or five <laughs> um and then i also have to be up to go dance with the seniors tomorrow at the dykeman center by 10 30 a.m so i'm gonna wrap this up and i'm gonna say for now good night and happy dream chasing show cheers and how sometimes you just wanted to go where everybody knows you for everybody that's watching this video if you have been inspired please give it a thumbs up 